everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna do my 2020 Christmas house tour and I am so excited to show you guys what I've done. I think I've decorated more rooms than I ever have and I'm so excited to show you guys what I have done and give you all the inspiration and all the motivation to get your home decorated for Christmas this crazy 2020 year. If this, the, this is the first video that you are wa watching of mine, welcome. My name is Dream. I am a mama of two. Um, I live in Southern California with my hubby and my children, and I enjoy cleaning, organizing, decorating, any of that homemaking content. If that is your jam, like it is mine, please don't hesitate to join my little YouTube family. So without further ado, please enjoy my 2020 house tour. Let's get started. So I have this Noel sign up. I got it from Michael's last year. I typically try to get their signs and such when things are 50% off. So I think I got that for around $9.99. This wreath here, I actually made it. I got the form from Michael's a few years back. And then I've added in the pine cones, the silver bow, the berries, all of that stuff, I added it in. Just picks that I picked up from Michael's and Hobby Lobby over the years. And then in this corner, you guys know I always like to do a little vignette. And then I have this big plant here that is from the Home Depot. It came in that red tin. I have this white poinsettia. This Farm Fresh Christmas Tree Cut and Carry sign that is from my local grocery store. Um, my little um, tea light lantern there. And then just some pine cones that you can, we have um, around my school, there's a lot of pine trees. So pine cones that you can pick up. And then my mat is from um, Home Goods. And then the black mat under it, I have had for some time now. So there you guys go. My front porch, Christmas 2020. Let's go inside. Over here. So I will pan over here and show you guys this first. So um, this picture is always up there. That is from Michael's. I've had it for some time. Anything in this video that I am able to link, I will do that. Um, and then I have these hooks that we put up. Those are from Amazon and they came in a huge pack, probably like 12 for maybe 12, $13. Um, this flowers and garden 10, I got that from Michael's, um, when they had like their summer sale, but it's just kind of neutral decor. I use it all the time. I put in some lamb's ear in there, a little frosted lamb's ear that I picked up from Walmart. And then I have this huge sack that I picked up last year from Michael's. It says North Pole Special Delivery. It's one of those um, sacks like for all your presents. I thought that was cute on there. And then I have this real lantern that I got from um, Amazon. It came in a pack of two and I have the small one hung up there. And then I have my boots that are always there and a little basket for my guests to put their shoes. And then over here, I love this binge. It is from Tractor Supply. And I have that there with a throw blanket from um, Target, the Threshold brand, a pillow that is from Home, um, not Home Goods, from Michaels, and then another one of those lanterns from Amazon. And then this is so adorable. I will link her Instagram handle down below. It's one of my girlfriends. She made this little plate for me and I just, we use it on Christmas, but I just have it out displayed because it's just so cute. Um, she did mine with the metal and um, wood on the bottom. Um, she can use kind of any tray that you would like, but I will link her shop down below. So support small shops, but it says, Dear Santa. And then it has the snowflakes. And then on Christmas Eve, you're going to put Rudolph's carrots there, the cookie for Santa, 
And then this area is further drained. I got this container for my local grocery store. It says Milk for Santa, and I thought it was perfect. And then both of my children, there's Dominic and Brooklyn, and it says Love Dominic and Brooklyn. And then I just have it sitting with one of these little tea towels, and this one is from Target. And it came in a pack of two, a red one and this plaid one, and it was only $9.99. And then in this corner, I always have um, that tree, and that is from Hobby Lobby. And then I have a few lanterns down here. This is one of my favorite lanterns. It is so chippy. Not necessarily Christmas decor, but it is gorgeous. It is typically $109 at Hobby Lobby, but... I am not gonna pay that. And I only paid, I got it when it was 50% off, but it was one of my birthday gifts. And you guys know I love home decor, so of course I would want a, a home decor piece for my birthday gift. But I just thought it that kind of seafoam green just goes great with all of the Christmas decor. So that's kind of our little entry set. This way, family pictures are flanking my little um, bookcase here. On the top, I have uh, this weighted scale from Kirkland's, a huge R, and I did a whole video on uh, um, this. So I have this huge R from Michael's, the foam balls are from Michael's, and then some vintage um, pots that you can make easily, and then just some berries, and then inside, This whole hutch is from Target. I will link it if I can find it. Um, we have our family books that my husband, um, my sister-in-law made for us. And then I have these little ho, ho, ho bowls. They are Ray Dunn and they are from Home Goods. And then some DIY pine cones. I'm gonna have a video showing you a few DIY things that you can do um, for the holidays. Um, this ceramic tree from Target. And then this area, I have this metal house from um, Hobby Lobby. And then I just put a little wreath on there. I thought it was really cute. I have some trees from, um, those are from the Target Dollar Spot as well. They were $3 a piece. And then I have another family picture, more pictures, and then some old books. I just took the covers off of them. And then this little believe sign from the Target dollar spot. I believe it was last year. It was about three bucks, but that's what I have going over here. My little bookcase, the little setup there, and then more family pictures. And then in this corner, I have our tree. This is our big tree. Um, and I'll give you a closer, and we are not done decorating it. Um, we just have, I just threw a few base ornaments on here for this video, but oh my goodness, I love this. I wanted some words somewhere on my tree, um, and it says it's the most wonderful time of the year, and I thought this was so gorgeous, and I wanted it displayed. So my tree, there's tons more ornaments that we have to put on, but I just threw in the picks already. Um, I have these snow covered picks, these picks, these are all from Michaels. Um, and then I threw on a few, me and my daughter Brooklyn put on a few bulbs so the tree wouldn't be bare for this video. And then our bow on top, I actually made it with fabric that um, I picked up from the Christmas tree store in San Diego. So um, I have tons of that little, it's falling, but. I have just the ribbon in there, different kinds of ribbon. But yeah, our tree is not done, but I'm loving it so far. But we usually have a whole production. We eat cookies, we play music, and we decorate it together as a family. But I have some base ornaments on there so you guys wouldn't see it bare. But there's our tree. And then my skirt this year for the tree, I chose to use this little wicker um, basket. I picked that up from... Um, where did I pick that up? I pick this, I picked this up from, um, Hobby Lobby and it was 50% off. So I paid about 20 some dollars for it. 
And then I have this train that we picked up a few years back from Home Depot and that always goes around our big tree. And then this sign is personalized, that's our last name, and that is from Farm Signs Co. and I will link their shop down below as well. To our tablescape. So on the back of my chairs, I also did a whole video on this, but I have these wreaths from Hobby Lobby and then just some burlap um, that I got from Hobby Lobby and you'll see it used throughout my home. Um, the place settings that I did this year, very simple, very easy, just burlap as my runner. You can get this from Amazon. I have these um, chargers from Hobby Lobby. These ones are from Michael's, the silver ones. White plates from Macy's. Napkins from Hearth and Hand. Ribbon that I picked up at Walmart and I just put it around. And then a little sprig that I picked up from Hobby Lobby. And then my tablescape is pretty simple. So I have the two trees that are flanking it. Um, those DIY pine cones. Some of that um, lamb's ear that I picked up from Walmart. This cute little Merry Christmas sign that I have from the Target dollar spot last year. And then my little lanterns with little tea lights in them that I have from Michael's. So just very simple, very easy, and I absolutely love it. And then my table, I always tell you guys this, but my husband made table, chairs, everything. So I can't link that. We have this little distressed little reindeer, and I've had him for many years, and he is from Home Goods, and we absolutely love him. He's like a part of the family. And then I have this wreath here, and that is from Hobby Lobby. Um, the mirror, I'm not sure my mother-in-law gifted, gifted that to me. Um, and then I have these vintage bells strung across, and they are so pretty and gorgeous. And then down there's this little basket. I have a little lantern and that is from Michael's. Um, this, I think it could be a scarf, a throw. That is actually from uh, the Target dollar spot probably three years ago, a pillow from Home Goods. And then this is just a pillow cover and that is from Amazon. And then I have our little village. And this village was my husband's village when he was a young boy. And um, my mother-in-law gave it to us several years ago. And our children have enjoyed it as well. And it is the North Pole. And then the rest of the area is just decorated really simple. Um, I have those snowballs and we actually do have a snowball fight all the time, but this is kind of like neutral decor that we always have out. And then I just put a little Christmas tree on the bottom. And then there is a picture of me and the hubs, but just very simple and I have this little candle from Target. It was only around five bucks and it smells so good. Um, one of their little Christmas candles. Um, this is always here. It's an arrangement that my mom sent me for Mother's Day, but it's still going pretty strong. And then over here, I just, and of course we didn't start yet. I just have our little countdown to Christmas. That is our, some people have junk drawers. We have a junk bowl. So that's our junk bowl. But um, this is our little countdown to Christmas. And I got that from uh, the Target dollar spot, I think two years ago, and it was just a few bucks. So our kitchen, we have our towels. They are all from, the red one is from Target and the one with the Christmas trees is from um, Home Goods. And then in this corner, we have the little glass jar, which is from Target and it has berries and then some of those DIY um, pine cones in it and that is all from uh, the the berries are from uh, Hobby Lobby and then the fa la 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 sign is another Hobby Lobby find I think originally it's like $5.99 and I got it half off and then I have my 
Peppermint Mrs. Myers little setup going on there. And then I added in the Christmas trees and then I haven't had those for years. Um, I'm thinking they are from Michael's, but I've had them for a really long time. And then our little setup over here. So we have the cookies for Santa jar and that is from Target this year. It was $5. Those famous Target um, Santa mugs. I think they have the cutest ones. Everybody has their own like variation, but I really like theirs. And they have brown Santa too. I just didn't purchase more, but these I've had since last year. They're really cute. And I have a, just a little sprig in there that is from the Target dollar spot. The Believe tray is from the Target dollar spot last year. And then all of my canisters, I've had those for years and they're from Home, home Goods. And then that big tray in the back, that is also from Home Goods. And then we have this little pedestal here, and that is from Hobby Lobby. And then that, you guys know I'm obsessed with houses. That little house on there is also from the Target dollar spot this year. It was $5. And I just put a little wreath on it and then added some bottle brush trees that are um, also from Target. And we are calling it done. So that is my kitchen. And then I have this tea tower here and that is from the Target dollar spot last year. For here, I just have this wreath that I always have hanging up. I just do throw a little bow on it to give it a little Christmas sparkle. And then I have a couple more tea towels here. Fireplace. This is what I did this year. And I'm gonna have a whole video on like my step-by-step -step tricks about designing and styling a fireplace. But let's start up top. I have this huge wreath here and that is from Home Depot a few years ago. I just threw in some berry picks to add a little red in there. And then I also added in that red bow to throw a little red in as well. Um, the mirror behind it is from Pier One and I've had it for so long and so are the candles and the candle holders. And then I have this welcome sign that I picked up from Walmart during the fall and I love it. I just love the wood and the metal. It just goes with my style. I put these two little um, pine trees here. They are um, frosted and or flocked, sorry, frosted. <laughs> They are flocked and I love them and they are from Target last year and they were three or five dollars, somewhere around there. You guys know my obsession with houses, so I have a few white houses here and these are from the Target dollar spot two years ago. And then our, our um, stocking holders, these ones are from Home Goods and they came in a pack of four. And then these little tree ones, those ones are actually from the Target dollar spot two years ago. So I like to mix the wood and the white and I think it looks really cute. And then I picked up some of this, um, these lights and they are from actually my local grocery store. And I like them because they're on a timer and then they have different modes that you can do. And then all of the greenery is from the dollar section at Target. So the Target dollar spot. But that is what I have working for our mantle. And then our stockings are from Personalized Mall. And I just absolutely love them. I They are embroidered. So we have Dad, Mom my Dominic and my Brooklyn. And um, they have a little sparkle to them and they are from Personalized Mall. Um, and I, we've had them, Brooklyn's is probably the newest one. So that one, she'll be four this year. So that one's four years old. And the rest of them, we have had them for a very long time, but I know they still carry them. And then that little burlap sash in the background, that is also from Hobby Lobby. But this is my mantle, and I absolutely love it. And here we have my little's play area garland, and that is from the Target dollar spot. She has a little tree over here. That's one of those metal trees from Michael's. I just made a bow out of some ribbon I got from Walmart. It has, she put her little figurines down here, a little Christmas figurines, but we have um, some lights on there from the Target dollar spot. 
her little easel. We have zhuzhed that up with some clings from Walmart. And then that is a little elf that she was gifted. And then her little kitchen area. We just have um, that little tea towel that is a Santa. He's so cute. And he's from um, the Target dollar spot. And then we have a lantern up here and then just a let it snow sign. The lantern is from Amazon and the let it snow sign is from the Target dollar spot. So we kept it pretty simple, but it's still super cute and just adorable for my I didn't own. do much anything crazy. I have a whole video on how I decorated our little pencil tree in the corner. Um, but I didn't do anything too crazy in here. Um, I did it this kind of like woodland theme. It's so cute, I love it. I made the little bow on top. It's super duper cute. And then my tree skirt, I've had it for a really long time from Home Goods. And then over here in this little area, price tags off stuff. I have this little tree from Home Goods and I still wanna take the price tag off. And then it's just on like a home body book. And then in this corner, I did add some winter sprigs to the greenery that is already pretty neutral. Um, I did change out. So we have this. Uh, these are from the Target dollar spot last year. These little Believe um, cup, not cup holders, but, you know, to put your drinks on. And then this this little sprig set that was from Walmart. And then I had just have a candle burning and that candle was from Michael's. That's holiday cookies. But just kept it simple and cozy. Room down here. I just added this little tree and that was from um, the Target dollar spot. I have a little um, reindeer. He's so cute. And then these soaps in the amber jars, I absolutely love them. And they are from Amazon. I will link those down below. And then we have our stairs and we have um, garland from Walmart. And I have burlap ribbon and then another type of ribbon. And I'll go on the other side to show you guys better. And it's just kind of going up our stairs, but I'll show you how we attached it. So we attached it. We got this wire um, stuff from Michael's and I just, we just wrapped it around and we attached it that way. And then the ribbon is just going throughout it. So, and I just tucked it to make it work. So that's the other side. But we'll go back around and then I can show you. Just looks really pretty and super simple. My stairs, I love them. They're probably one of my favorite features in our home. Okay, we have made our way upstairs, so we are going to go into the kids' room. So first is my oldest son, and this is his room. Um, we didn't do a ton of stuff up here. Um, he does collect snow globes, but we just used the one that we got this year. And then I put a few bottle brush trees there. On his bed, we just added this Made With Love Mrs. Claus pillow, and that is from the Target dollar spot. The snow globe is actually from um, Home Goods. And then this is his setup for his tree. It's a six foot tree from Walmart. It was only $30. And the ornaments are all from Walmart as well. And the picks, um, more ornaments are actually going to be added on this tree when we go through um, the family ornaments. So more ornaments are gonna be added on this tree, but I wanted to show you guys how everything looks now that is kind of it and then he has i just used a blanket as his um skirt and it's just a blanket from target and then this is two santa claus from the best kid in the world or kids in the world since i have two 
This is a pillow that I picked up from Michael's. And I did a dedicated clean and decorate with me for my kid's room. So there you go. I'll show you, I guess, some of my favorites. I loved these little ones and they were around $1.99. And then, and I think they just go so well with his room decor. His name is Dominic, so we have a big um, wooden D. His star is really cool. That was from Walmart as well. And then this ribbon is gorgeous and it's um, burlap. But yeah, that's his little tree. My daughter's room. And this is her setup. So for her room, we added, she actually put these here. We had these stockings I got years ago from um, Target and we just hung them on the hooks here. She has these hooks. These hooks are from Hobby Lobby. And then um, her tree is from Walmart and then her ornaments are from Walmart and um, I'll give you... And I did a dedicated room, like I said, for my kids' room. And it's daylight, so you can't really see the twinkling lights. But this tree is like an ombre tree. It is so stinking cute. If you have a little girl in your life and she loves pink and sparkles. And then her ornaments. We have some that are from Michael's. The balls are from Walmart. Unlike my son, hers are from different spots. All of his ornaments were from Walmart. But um, these are from Michael's as well. And all of their Christmas stuff was half off. And then so were these. The little reindeer was from Walmart this year. So you can run out and grab this stuff. And then all the balls came in a kit. And they were like $4.99. And you got, I think, like 12 or so. And then her topper, which the lighting is kind of bad, but... It's like these little palms and this, and that is from Walmart as well. So, and then for her tree, just like my son, I just threw one of her blankets around it. This one is from Personalized Mall. She's had it since she was a baby. It's like a cream color and it has her name on it. And then just a little pillow that she always has on her bed. And there's a table under here. So her tree is four feet. And then my son's tree is the six footer. And then on her little chair here that she reads stories, we just have this little pillow from the Target dollar spot last year. And then on her little dresser, we have this sleigh bells ring sign that was from the Target dollar spot last year. And then some of those Target dollar spot bottle brush trees. And that is it. Okay, guys, we are all done. I'll show you what I did for this area, I just added that little barn. It has a light. It's morning, so you can barely see it. But it has, I put my little string lights in there. There's my books. And then this little tree. And then there's our bed with our Amazon bedding. Like I said, any links that I can find, I will link them down below. And that little pu um, pillow cover. So cute. This little throw is from Home Goods, so I can't link it, but adorable. In front of us, we have his little lamp thing is from Target. One of those bottle brush trees, and then another bottle brush tree. And then the big window, we have that hearth and hand wreath just hanging there. And I think it looks really cute. So just small little touches, but it brings a little Christmas cheer to our bedroom. Above our bed, we have those signs that we always have. And then I added a little garland, two boxes from Amazon, and then um, the monitor for my daughter. And then that is it. Hey, thank you guys so much. We are at the end. Thank you guys for sticking with me. 
and seeing all the areas in my home that I have decorated for Christmas. Let me know down in the comments below your favorite thing for the video. If you've decorated already, maybe you haven't yet and you're just waiting and holding out, let me know down in the comments below. I love getting to know you guys and staying connected. But don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. I will have my other Christmas videos linked down in the description box below. And then I will have as many links as I can find also linked down in the description box below so you guys can do easy shopping. But thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a blessed day. Bye.